After you have a huge success like Garden State, the thing grossed about $30, $40 million at the box office. Am I correct? Yeah. You made it for what, like $2 million bucks? We made it for everyone. And this is the story. Everybody passed on it. So I was on Scrubs. I get Natalie Portman, who, who's, who loves it, and she wants to be in it. And I shop it around town, and I've, I'm on a new hit show, and I've got Natalie Portman, and I'm like, wow, this is cool. I'm going to make a movie. Right. Everybody in town passes on it. Every <laughs> single person says no. He went to every studio. Everywhere. Every studio, every rich guy, everyone with a phone and a desk passed on it. Why do you think it. they passed on it? It wasn't a traditional screenplay. It didn't follow really all the rules. You know, there's all this stuff about, you know, three-act structure. You know, this should be happening by this page. And, right. and I didn't follow any of that. I just wrote a cool, what I thought was a cool story. And right. I thought, and I wrote about what I, what I was feeling at the time. I was sort of a depressed, uh, even though I was successful, I was in a depressed place. And, and, and Why I, were you depressed? Um, I don't know. I've, I've battled depression in my life, and, and 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 if you have, it comes at a time sometimes when things are going really well. So I wrote it about that, and and everyone passed on it, and it was about to fall apart. And I met this like sugar daddy who was in the mortgage, made a bunch of money in the mortgage business. Right. He wanted to get into entertainment. He didn't know anything about it, but he had a lot of capital to spare. He liked Natalie Portman. He liked me, and he said, "Any, you know, we, we our budget at the time was like six million dollars." But when a guy who's not in the business, who's just going to, aren't you nervous as hell? Yeah, but I had money? no other option, Howard. I had like I, it was it was about to not happen at all. Would or, he say stuff to you like, "This is going to make money, right?" Yeah. But he had he had lots of advisors. I mean, he 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 wasn't in the business, but he had lots of talking heads in his ear. And right. and 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 so he said, you know, our budget at the time was six million dollars. And he goes, look, is there any way you can make this movie for two and a half? And we, we were like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. At the, at the time, we were That's... like, fuck, I don't know. Um, yeah, right. If we cut a lot of, but I had amazing producers, and they figured it out, and we made this movie for in twenty five days for two and a half million dollars. It's pretty amazing that he put up two and a half million dollars of his own money, yeah. based on a script he read, yeah, and you know doesn't really know what two and a half million dollars gets him. I had no idea, and he just totally rolled the dice on me. Wow! And then who he, is this guy? His yeah. name's Gary Gilbert, and he's become a, a successful um, film uh, producer. What? What an unbelievable story. Um, How'd you know what you were doing? You never directed before. I went to film school, and I, I'd made short films before. Where did you go to film school? Northwestern. And that's a See, pretty that's good what I wanted. Yeah, that's yeah. what I wanted to do. I wanted to act, and I loved acting, but I really wanted to make movies. I really wanted to make films. And when I got Scrubs, I was like, the first thought that came to my mind was, oh, this is going to help me get my movie made. And you have an amazingly loyal fan base. Yes, I, I've been very clear ever since Scrubs and Garden State, my, the two things I'm most known for, how, how lucky I am. I wrote a play, and I took it to London, my first play, and I started in London, we sold out this theater in the West End for f four months. Wow. And it's because of this loyal fan base that just supports everything I do.